two of my December daily that I will be doing throughout the month of January. So we had finished day one and now we're going into day two. I'll go ahead and take out my pages that I'll be working with. So I'll be working on the back side of day one and this side. So I have a left and a right. You'll find going forward that I do typically do a left and a right spread. And here are my photos. I typed out my journaling and these are my photos here. I found this really nice overlay. It says social distancing and I found it was the perfect overlay for this layout. COVID and being home by ourselves for Christmas, I found that a lot of events were cancelled. So we really got creative with the events that we went to. And I thought for the day two layout, it would be fun to talk about uh, the virtual events that we attended. The first virtual event that we went to was my husband's work party and it was called a glass turkey. And basically you bought tickets and if your ticket was drawn, you uh, won. A bottle of wine or uh, anyway we ended up winning three different beverages <laughs> everyone kept commenting on how lucky we were that our number kept getting drawn so that is the journaling for this event and the other event that I talked about was the tree lighting our community does a tree lighting annually in the past I've had a full page layout for this event but what I did is took a picture of our TV in our living room and we watched the tree lighting live on our TV. And I thought I would show you uh, last year's tree lighting. Um, it was a two page spread and we went on horse drawn wagon rides. And this is the tree here and we were standing under the gazebo. So that just gives you an idea of just how much this Christmas is different from last year. So I'm going to go ahead and put this video in fast forward and put this all together. I begin by taking out all of my cards. I pretty much know where I want everything to go. My journaling is on a card from Allie Edwards from last year. And I use my date stamper to put on the date. Uh, for this spread I have two photos and they're from two uh, virtual events that we attended. I find for this year uh, I have a lot of layouts that I have one photo for uh, which is funny because it's not like me. <laughs> I normally have the opposite problem of having a ton of photos for a layout. Um, so I have to get creative with a single photo spread. I looked at a bunch of different odds and ends from the kit and I couldn't quite figure out what to put in each circle and I love that 4x6 card. I think it's beautiful as it is. Um, so because it's dealing with uh, drinks and kind of being with one another virtually, commenting uh, virtually, uh, I just thought cheers was a good uh, phrase to put right in the center of that card. The uh, alpha stickers are from Felicity Jane. And I go ahead and take out a number two. It's a black number from Allie's kit this year. And I'm just in love with the little metallic or metal red heart. I just felt like the journaling card needed a little pop of color. And this card is supposed to be for journaling, but I just thought it really circled around the two very nicely. I take out other bits from the kit. It is a ton of coppery black phrases. And literally every word you can think of, there are so many. Uh, and I'm trying different little combinations 
and I end up picking today's tradition and it's pretty accurate because we've been doing the tree lighting for the past four Christmases. And I'm looking at some Ellie Studio sticker sheets and I'm loving the stars this year. So I have a forest green star and a light green star. And that's it for my day two. I'm going ahead to slip everything back into the pockets. I hope to see you all back for day three. And for day three, I'm working on a little tag book that Ali showed how to make in her process videos and also the left side of the page. I'll see you next time. Bye.